Hey YouTube, Sam here. Yeah, I'm just pulling some of these pallets apart here that I got for free. And uh, got one of these little crowbars. They actually work really well. This is a Harbor Freight one. I couldn't find my other one, so I had to go buy another one. Something else I did, kind of did the hockey wrap on this where you wind up the tape, roll it around, then tape it up. Gives you a little bit more comfort in your hand. So if you're going to be doing this for a while, it kind of takes some of the vibration off and some of the uh, stress off your hands a little bit there. But something about these pry bars is everybody always kind of jams them in there and starts prying like that. Um, you know, that works well with this side too. But uh, something about these pry bars that a lot of people probably know and some people probably don't, For this is for the ones that don't. If you take these, Get them on in there, and instead of trying to pry that way, you actually push down on it. See how easy that comes apart there? And do another one here. Now I'm not worrying about completely saving every board because these are pallets and you just aren't going to save every board. Some of them will pull apart, but this seems to, for the most part, okay, this one is coming in there, it goes. But sometimes they're not quite that easy, you got to go back and forth. But even, I mean, I don't know if you can see that bottom one there. Next one down here. Let's see where we're at. I'm going to pull this one in. And that gets quite a bit of it. But if I reef on this, I'm reefing on it with my knee. That came apart, but it still was a lot harder than just what I did here where they pushing down on it usually you'll push down push up they'll usually pop apart anyhow it's a simple trick easy way to use a pry bar and an easy way to actually pull these pallets apart this is sam jack of all master of none i guess you can consider that a jack of all tips and tricks all right you